The network of African Methodist Episcopal churches stretches across five continents, and this morning, each congregation added elements to the service to strengthen their faith and connectedness after Wednesday's attack. Our Brianna Connor visited a local AME church and explains how they are finding forgiveness and strength. This first Sunday since the Emanuel Nine were killed in Charleston, AME churches across the country and here in Winston-Salem have tailored their services to offer comfort to the congregation. For those who mourn, the sanctuary at St. James AME has been open since Thursday. Now three days later, people here are starting the service on one accord with every other AME church. Nine notes ring out from the altar honoring the nine innocent lives stolen at Mother Emanuel during a prayer service on Wednesday night. The doors of the church are still open. A litany added to the service also reminds St. James that they're connected with other believers who share a faith that can't be stolen. We do want to give a message of, of healing and hope, reconciliation and prayer and we do have to, to move forward. The title of today's sermon is How to Have Good Success. So we want to move from this tragedy uh, speaking about having success, success through the Word of God, success as brothers and sisters, success as a faith community, success in uh, showing forgiveness and, and, and showing that we have to move from this and move beyond. Though the pastor tells me they are called to a higher sense of vigilance, today during service the congregation declared despite everything that's happened, the doors of the church are still open. Reporting in Winston, I'm Brianna Connor, WXII 12 News.